Hey everybody, Tyler here on the Dragon Rider Network, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys my first impressions of the Nexus 7. So I've had this for a little bit over a week, and I'm really enjoying it so far, so I'm just giving you guys my first impressions here on the Dragon Rider Network. And as you can see, it's very snappy, everything just flows very nice. And at the bottom here, we have our multitasking button. And to get rid of apps, you just swipe them to the left or to the right. And then we have a back button. And so we're just going to open up Twitter. And we're just going to go to something. We'll just go to a profile just to show you how back, the back button works. All you got to do is just press it. And you just go back and you're the whole way back to the home screen. And so we're just going to open up Instagram now. And <laughs> we'll just use the home button. And the home button will just take us right back to the home screen. So there are no physical buttons on the front. But on the back, we do have the Nexus logo, and we do have buttons for the power, the volume rocker, and we have dock connectors on the side. And on the bottom, we have a speaker grill, and then our headphone jack and USB port. And so that's basically all we have I'm on the back, and we have a microphone up on the top. We have a front-facing camera at the top for things like Skype and other applications. And so now we're just going to look at the notifications, and I do have a widget installed for different options and uh, commands. Um, but as you can see, it just flows very nice. Right here is Google Now. Um, that was a no notification for Google Now for the Pirates game, so we can just slide that right out of there. And that's one way to get to Google Now. This is another way, swiping up from the bottom. Um, that takes you to Google Now along with using this microphone right here, um, Google Now Dictation. So there are many other cool features that this tablet has, and it is a great tablet for the value. I got the 16 gigabyte version, which is $250. Um, the 8 gigabyte version for $200 is a great value as well. Um, there's no other tablet out there for this price that is this good. I mean, I've seen the Kindle Fire, but um, people have been saying this is like 10 times better than that. Um, but it's just such a great um, device because the software and the hardware works together very well. Jelly Bean works flawlessly in my opinion. There are a couple issues with some apps not working quite right on Jelly Bean and the Nexus 7, um, but apps are getting updated frequently and so they will be working in the future. But you know, everything just works just fine and it, everything just flows very well. As you can see, there's no lag here. I can just swipe through my whole Twitter feed till who knows when and nothing lags and everything just performs very well. One thing I have noticed though that I'm curious about is if I can add shortcuts on the lock screen because all I can get to is the unlock and Google Now. And I'd like to put some other things like Google Chrome or Twitter on there, um, but that's really not a big deal. And that's not really a downfall. That's just me not knowing if things work. Um, also, you can't put the home screen in landscape. Uh, you can put other applications in landscape, but you can't put the home screen. So for example, Twitter works fine in landscape mode, um, but the home screen itself always stays in portrait. It's just another minor detail, not necessarily a bad thing, but just something you might want to know if you're thinking about this. So this has been my first impressions of the Nexus 7. I absolutely love this thing. I think it's awesome. So if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the Dragon Rider Network for more videos. And don't forget to check out my channel. The full review of this will be going on there as well. That is T Game and Tech. The link will be in the description below. So thank you guys for watching this video on the Dragon Rider Network. And I'll see you guys in the next one.